Hi, I'm Peter Ely, curator of the Quick and the Dead here at the Walker Art Center. In front of me I have a piece by Brazilian artist Lydia Clark that she made in 1960. Clark began as a geometric abstract painter, but gradually became more and more interested in collapsing the inside and the outside, and the front and the back, the kinds of things that normally we take for granted with a two-dimensional picture plane. So she began by making foldable sculptures, essentially. A work like this, which looks, in many cases, like it could be displayed on the wall, but was in fact meant to be opened, folded, and reconfigured by her audience into a range of different shapes all of which could move, and none of which remain static. There is no right way to show this sculpture, because there is no front, there is no back, likewise there's no inside or outside. That lack of distinction, in some sense, parallels Clark's own obsession throughout her life with death and trying to imagine it. In that sense, what looks like a small metal sculpture, and is, in fact, ties into larger existential issues that she was grappling with.